Shooting photos and videos with prescription glasses could seem straight out of a sci-fi movie. Last year, Google made it possible when it unveiled Google Glass. However, people with a short-sighted prescription might have problems adapting. That's where smart frames come in. Smart frame really, what it boils down to be, it's just an eyeglass frame with a computer that attached to the frame. So in a situation with like with a Google Glass, uh, this is the computer, this is the battery, this is the camera, and this is the display. Okay, and it attached to a frame that you can put on your face. So this is what a smart frame is all about. The smart frame we call it smart frame because our design differs from the Google frame design is because our frames attach to the middle. Okay. Where is the Google Frame attached to the, to the side? Okay. The advantage of our design is that for our lenses, we're designed when you have open it up and close, it still stay at the same curve. So it's going to be really beneficial when you have higher prescription uh, that is needed to be fitted in there. It will stay true to the prescription, no matter if it's for a big hat or for a small hat. Well, first of all, when you design frames for, or lenses for Google Glass, you have to follow what is already there. For Google Glass, it's, there's an eye bow, bow bra. And this has come with the Google Glass that we cannot take away. So Rochester Optical has developed a system to lock the frames onto the bow bra. So this is what we have to follow is to design the mechanism, the frames to work together with the locking system. And also to avoid that is certain obstacle for the sensor in side that, that used for censoring your blinking of your eyes so we have to work on the design to accommodate all this ob obstacle these are the, the barrier that we have to focus on when we design the frames for the uh, Google Glass. Well the market is going to be huge because in Asia people like technology people are very easy to adopt new technology they welcome new technology in fact so what we are doing here, we are introducing this new technology to Asia and I know that the fact that people will be accepting this new technology because it provides you a lot of additional benefits that your cell phone can do but you're going to do it on your face, it could be so much more convenient.